All right, so we're here at World Champion Outdoors in Atmore, Alabama, and uh, they're a local elite dealer. They have the new Ethos, Kairos, and Allure in stock. So today, I'm gonna go through each one, do a review. So what we have is the new for 2024 Elite Allure. This boat is 31 inches axle to axle, six and a quarter inch brace height, weighs four pounds. Uh, they rated an IBO equivalent at 30 inch draw, 340 feet per second. Uh, the draw length range on this boat is from 23 to 28 and a half. So probably a little bit of estimation in there getting that number, but it comes shipped to the stores at 26 and a half inch draw and it does already have the smooth mod installed on it. So I think that's a good move because the smooth mod draws quite a bit smoother than the speed mod uh, or the performance mod. And uh, so we're gonna shoot it today just the way it comes shipped from the to the store. And that's at 26 and a half inch. And let's see what the weight is. That's 51.6 pounds. So basically shipped in here as a 50 pound bow. So what I'm gonna to do today is we're gonna shoot a 360 grain arrow and we're gonna shoot a 404 grain arrow. Give you an idea of how it performed for you. So we're gonna start with a 404 grain arrow. Let's get the decimal meter set up. Two, 73.2 decibels. Sorry, 73.7. All right, last one. Two forty four, seventy four point one. This is a three hundred sixty grain arrow. Two fifty eight and seventy two point nine. Two fifty nine. 73.5 all right last one this again this is a 360 grain arrow 253 73.6 all right, so that is the new for 2024 Elite Allure. And this bow is built specifically for ladies or short draw. Uh, again, 23 inch draw to 28 and a half inches. The specs on this bow, <clears throat> I'm shooting today at 26 and a half inches at 51.6 pounds. The 258 out of a 360 grain arrow and 242 feet per second out of a 404 grain arrow. Uh, Definitely respectable speeds if you ask me. Uh, the bow is very comfortable. It has the, the, the normal elite grip that feels great. <clears throat> They've really kind of thinned out the riser a little to get the weight down. Still has everything we would expect out of a flagship bow from Elite. It has the set technology. It has the Versa mods. 
It has the adjustable roller guard, uh, and it has adjustable let off from 70 to 90 percent. Uh, to me, those features set Elite apart from, from other companies. Uh, those features make tuning the Elite bows some of the easiest I've ever put in my hands. Uh, you owe it to yourself to get down to your local pro shop and try one of these bows out. Uh, I always recommend test driving a bow before you buy one. Uh, if you're in the South Alabama area, come see Angela or Logan at World Champion Outdoors. They've got a full line of archery equipment. Uh, if you want to come try the new Elite bows out, they've got everything from tree stands to saddle equipment to fishing equipment to uh, a new rifle if you want one of those too. Uh, appreciate you watching today if you haven't already click that like button and subscribe button and uh, come back and watch us again god bless shoot straight and i'll see you next time